When senior engineer Wei Mingshan shows us around one of the giant radars 35 kilometers from the launch area where Shenzhou 16 mission will start for space, we're also counting down to the most intense moments of the launch, closely watched by the team in the Dashuli area. Wei has seen it so many times. He's been here at Dashuli since the Shenzhou 1 spacecraft went up in 1999. But the first few minutes after the launch still makes him nervous, despite all the success and experiences in the years since. The most important stages of rocket or satellite launches are the launch phase and the return phase. These two stages are internationally recognized as the most dangerous. The launch phase involves many actions, and therefore there may be more risks involved. Human spaceflight is a matter of life and death. I've been in the space industry for a long time, and I've worked on many missions. But the more tasks I went through, the greater the pressure. Although the reliability and capabilities of our equipment have improved significantly, the pressure is still there. Wei says this measuring area alone devotes 10 pieces of equipment for the launch of the Shenzhou 16 mission, everything from radars to optical and telemetry equipment that will track the launch comprehensively. This time we're aiming for precision, accuracy, agility and stability. We'll have meticulous organization, accurate indicators, detailed work and stability. Both the people and equipment here are at their top level of performance and will cooperate to ensure the successful completion of the task. Some of their work in the past years is visible to us with the naked eye. Some of the previous Shenzhou mission's live broadcast images have come from the equipment here, including from this optical telescope. Wei shows us around. This telescope is what we relied on for optics when working on the launch of Shenzhou 1. After 20 plus years, we have now established comprehensive measurement and control capability. The change is comparable to the transition from 1G to 5G signal era for cell phones. Or we'll think of it as changes from only sending text to live broadcasting. The changes in our measurement and control capability over the years have been equally significant. And today, their goal remains the same, to keep the mission safe and successful. Sun Ye, CGTN, Jiuquan.